good afternoon uh, next part of the build the new ports is uh, the struts the wing struts and we start with the outer wing struts which are exactly the same construction as the undercarriage and that is plastic struts carbon fiber and plastic uh, stickers that go on the other side of it so I'll angle you down I'll angle you down and we'll make a start first ones is to remove part 15 and 16 the two outer struts which are held in the usual manner they press quite hard through this plastic just goes to show how uh, how strong it actually is strong but very flexible okay that's number 16 I need carbon that should be enough 43 mil 43 mil at the front 55 and 55 we put that against there I'm going to cut two 55s so there one there lift that up 55 there so I've got two at 43 two at 55 55 goes to the front 43 goes to the back something worth pointing out is right at the end here I'm not sure you'll see it there's two little holes and down in the bottom corners there's also two little holes uh, there two little holes there for rigging um, so don't get glue in them so we'll pop on little gap there so I'll smear it 55 to there and bring it equidistant from those holes won't be far out then similarly on the back spar 43 millimeter okay so that's the two spars outer spars done with the carbon fiber on so I'll glue this transfers on in a moment just give it a chance to dry and it's these four here that look like wing struts rather nice apply some saliva on it work out which way it goes that's a good one stick it down Like that. Okay. Next sticker. Line up the bands. And that makes for a very pretty strut, both sides, and very strong with it. So, moving on. That's the strut for that side. Let's put that one in there. Turn it like that. So that's those two in position. Very good. Now it's the centre cabane struts plastic part again. This time it's the inner cabane struts, which are part number 13 and 12. Something to note on the bottom of this strut is this is inner cabane strut. I don't know if you can just see there, at the end there's a white tab and there's a little score line to fold it over. Uh, don't cut that tab off or she won't be able to sit the cabane strut. I'll show you the picture. You've got to turn it over. You won't better sit the cabane strut onto the flat deck of the inner fuselage because you've cut it off. But that's what you glue down onto the flat. So 
just make sure you don't cut that off it might be easy to do you might think oh it's just a bit of white uh, but it's not a slight discrepancy on the instructions part in a Cobain strut part 13 and part 12 are it says here um, sandwich in between a length of carbon fiber rod 32 millimeters long uh, that's way too long it's by my reckoning about 17 or 18 mil I'm going to cut mine to 18 so you can ignore the 32 mil there so cut the carbon rod to 18 millimeters pop that on there stick it down making sure that I'm clear of the hole at the top and inside the score line at the bottom or the bend line I should say lay that to one side to dry do the other one could cut the next piece out while that's drying and that's front deck might look like I'm pressing quite hard but I'm not it's just you can actually hear it sort of crumpling into the foam you can sort of feel and hear a subtle change the score lines that will just bend very nicely now over the top deck I can't glue these in yet but I'm just going to offer it up while that has cabane's dry yeah it's going to go on there lovely and I want sticker 18 yeah I agree with that and stick it Okay, Inner Cobain's finished. Inner Cobain's attach to aircraft and audit for a minute. Right on the edge, like that. Put the top wing on, it'll also locate itself when I put the front deck on. So Cobain's on as per instructions. Again, quite nice little progress there. Next job is to fit the front deck in. Can't do that until obviously those front cabanes are set. So I'll pause there for a minute, come back shortly. Hope you're enjoying the show. And uh, I'm quite pleased with the build, it's coming on nicely. But on the next page, it's uh, the rear cabane, center cabane, which is angled like that. Oh, and the uh, headrest as well. Which I could play with now. I'm going to score down to the tip. Like that. And then I'm going to do lots of scores. Fanning out. And I'm going to bevel the uh, edges. Pick up a nice shape. Which should, in theory, sit on the back clever, of the... Clever, clever. Maybe bit fiddly to get that on. Doesn't quite meet the, the bottom so what I've done I've just taken the foam down there because it's cut at that angle I've just taken it down at that angle and it's fitting a lot better now and going down so I'm going to sit that on there so I'm going to fit the front deck in a minute We'll then be moving on to the next part, centre rear cabane strut. So thanks for looking in. Like and subscribe if you do like it. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. So I'm just carrying on with the uh, windscreen rear cabane strut with windscreen built in. So I've just turned over the plastic parts, glued them on. Uh, had to open the, open, cut down the back quite a lot just to get it to fold over. It doesn't matter if it's in two parts or not anyway so i've got to fold it over again but i'm just going to wait for the glue to set on that i've got the top top on i can put the transfers down each side to cover up the join 
and I've also put on the headrest streamlining bit. So we're coming along. Okay, that was a tricky bit. So that's hopefully in place. As soon as that's set, I can put the stickers on down each side and that will complete the Cobain strut assembly. Lip. Next step is the top wing on the build and it's pretty simple. Top wing, uh, we've got what one, two, three, four ribs to put on. A uh, gun sight goes in the middle, it's a bit interesting. And that's it. So it's nothing you haven't already seen me doing on the lower wing. So what I'll do is to probably speed through this bit so as you can get to the interesting piece, the gun sight. Oh, then the rigging. As soon as this top wing, we've got to rig, rig the aeroplane up because I can't stick the top wing on until all the rigging's loosely put on the aeroplane. At this stage, we don't tighten anything up, obviously. I can glue the top wing on, then she's gonna really take shape. These glasses are odd, aren't they? Then it'll really take shape. Brilliant, okay, let's put that there. Without further ado, and say I'm probably gonna speed this bit up. That wing rib is in place, and the two little holes, you can see the wing rib shining through the Depron, and the two little holes are letting light through just one there. That, so, we can get on with the next one. gun sight but look a bit more of a tripod mount now where well, turn it out way there you go it's there like that real one goes there and that one there should just in theory go in there and there with a gun sight next operation is the rigging I need my rigging tool, which is very, very fine indeed. See that? Okay, so that completes the rigging. Looks a bit of a mess at the moment, but you absolutely have to keep it nice and loose. Next step is going to be fitting the top wing. Ensure the tabs on the top of the strut work. Insert fully into the corresponding slots in the wing. Secure and allow adhesive to set. Dry fit before gluing. You've got to glue the strut top positions. The uh, and the bottom the bottom of the struts but only once it's all uh, assembled so what i'm going to do now is to offer things up and see how they look so where do you start oh look at that looks lovely um, let's start in the middle on the gun sight i wonder if it might be easier to do it upside down i've never thought of doing this before let's have a look Kind of makes sense. It's very tempting to glue those actually because there's going to be an element of play in the outside ones, but there's virtually no element of play in the front ones. So, and let's put that wing on. Make sure it's pressed down both sides. So it's 
okie dokie so that back one is dried a little bit so I'm going to now put some glue on the front cabanes call me mad call me crazy might be unsticking this yet we'll see how it see how it goes in uh, front wing this side is over there I'm gonna put a little blob of glue in there on just on the front and see how it's looking as long as I've got some adjustment in it so the back rigging points on the top wing I can always loosen these off afterwards if I need to and start having a look at the wing incidences just tilt you up a bit okay both trailing edges there are on the top wing are low but they will pull out with rigging if I pull the lower wing looks pretty e even both sides I'm just going to play around with the wing incidents all that done for tonight I'm going to just finish the wing incidents is off to my satisfaction and then the next video will be starting the rigging so thanks for watching like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one thanks a lot bye